Hey, what's up, everybody? How you doing? This is uh, Masutelo, and uh, today I will be teaching you guys how to make a website just using Notepad. Uh, you're using basic HTML. I'm not gonna go with anything, anything too advanced because there's no need to. You can make something that simple. It's just giving out some simple information. So let's begin, shall we? We're gonna need a Notepad, for sure, of course. So just gonna open it. And let me put it in a way where you guys can see it all. Okay, now I will start by uh, starting the website, which is the HTML tag. Step this in. Uh, the top part of the website is called the head, so just step in the head. Following by the title, of course, because you're gonna want the the, the website to have a title. Okay, well, I'm gonna call mine tutorial website. Okay, now we gotta close the title tag. So basically, HTML is for the browser to know that it's a website. Uh, the head tag is to know that it is on the header on the top part. Uh, and title basically knows that that's a title. Okay, now that we got that done, we're gonna close the head tag. All all tags are always in. They always are closed. So remember, any tag you open, you must always end it. So right here, I have to end the head tag with just the with just a slash. Now um, we're gonna next tag is called body, which uh, is basically the the one that has all the information. Um, on this, we, that, that that's where you add all the actual information that you see on the website. So let's add a little bit of information. I'm gonna start by uh, making some space in between the the beginning of the of the web web page and the actual information. So I'm gonna add a break. I'm add around two breaks just to make sure. Just to, just to make sure that uh, there's no space. Following by the header tag, which is H1, and my uh, title will be and we're gonna close it as well. Now we're gonna follow with, with, with another break. Followed by another break, and then we can uh, add the paragraph tag, which is just a P within the the brackets. Now we can add some, some text, so we can add. Right now, you just hold shift and with the with the arrow key, so so you can so you can select that. Hold Control C to copy it. Hold Control B and just keep making. And uh, that that looks pretty enough. Uh, you can always just use the mouse and also just copy and paste as well. But uh, it's also good for you to know the shortcut sure, sure, sure sure keys, keys. So, press. We can close the paragraph text. Can I add another break? Can I, and then, and now we, we can add a little magic to the website it makes it look a little more interesting we can add an image now the type for image is img for image src for source equals to in quotes you can add the the, the image where it's already to the liberty of choosing a 
an image. This one looks interesting. Doesn't really matter, but sample. So I'm just gonna paste it right there. You guys can choose any one you want, and then we are going to in the quotations, and then we can add a tag called alt, which basically means that uh, little inf information that is under the image. So we're gonna call apple in quotations basically when you have your mouse over the image the little information will show up now 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 we're not gonna end and then like this and we are done with the image today. we can uh, let it break and most of them in another paragraph keep pasting uh let's paste this to make a little more space and close and then we, we, we're gonna close the body don't forget don't, don't forget this like I did right now because the world now show up and then we're gonna close the HTML as well and we are done. All we gotta do now is just save it. So we're gonna go to file, uh, save as. I hit uh, all. So um, let's save it. Uh, index the HTML. Don't, don't forget the HTML and uh, all files of course and just click save we can minimize this as a matter and uh, we, we have, have we have it right there now, now we just we just drag it and, and this is really how this is basically how it looks you see you can see it's that simple so um, I mean you, you can always go ahead and make something more advanced but this is just the basic of making a website it's basically the basics you know you can always go to, to a place like Google and, ser and search You can even go to this website, and this is basically, and this one is basically like gonna, gonna, gonna show you all the basics, even CSS, JavaScript, and PHP, which is always good for you to know. Uh, thank you for learning from me, and uh, I hope you subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys next time on my next video. Thanks, and uh, goodbye.